Uh, you guys, Thanksgiving is just three days away. <laughs> Are you sure that? I saw that tomorrow President Trump will pardon a turkey at the White House. <laughs> then he'll spend the next week criticizing it for not thanking him enough. He's like, <laughs> I should have let you get eaten. <laughs> Actually, the White House just posted photos of the two turkeys Trump will pardon. Uh, they also released photos of the two turkeys Trump refuses to pardon. Take a look. There they are. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> A bit of a scandal. A bit of a scandal. Really? Yeah. It came out that uh, National Security Advisor H.R. McMaster called President Trump an idiot and said he had the intelligence of a kindergartner. <laughs> and Trump said, oh, yeah, then why am I reading at a first grade level? <laughs> and tweeting at a sixth grade level. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> I'm going to go have lunch with the turkeys. <laughs> Wait, what? Not only am I partying them, I'm hanging out with them all week. Uh, this weekend, Trump sent a tweet where he criticized Senator Jeff Flake for saying bad things about, quote, your favorite president. People were like, he said bad things about Obama? Wait, I'm talking about, about me. I'm talking about... Well, this is pretty big. After saying that he'd let people import elephant trophies into the U.S., Trump got a lot of backlash from the public and changed his mind. Yeah, Trump really is really trying to win back animal lovers. He even made his own nature documentary that's coming out. Oh. Yeah, watch this. This is Donald Trump, and I love animals, which is why I made Trump's Planet Earth. And I'm going to tell you about all my favorite animals, such as the chimichanga, <laughs> the walrus, Mitch McConnell, the Topanga, Mufasa, and of course, my favorite, Orange Tan. <laughs> Weird, right? Orange tan. Orange tan. Wow. Meanwhile, Al Franken said that he isn't resigning, but will spend the next few days reflecting. Reflecting is a political term, meaning hope someone else gets busted and this whole thing blows over. <laughs> reflecting smart. Another big story here. Last night, Charles Manson died at the age of 83, which means today he met his new roommates, Adolf Osama and the Time Warner customer service rep. That's right. Charles Manson passed away. Then Dancing with the Stars was like, well, on to OJ. All right, here we go. We got to make some calls. Get on that. Uh, but this is cool. Last night, the, the balloons for the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade were inflated. It's a big deal. Uh, this year is actually the parade's 91st anniversary. Oh. Isn't that wild? That's amazing. Yeah. I, I think you can sort of tell the balloons are getting a little older, though. I'll, I'll show you what I mean. For example, here's what the Elf on the Shelf balloon used to look like. Uh, here's what it looks like now. You see what I'm saying? Oh. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I mean, that, here's what the Charlie Brown balloon used to look like. Here's what it looks like now. You see what I'm wow. saying? <laughs> and finally, here's what the Ronald McDonald used to look like. Here's what it looks like now. And it's just oh. very, very... It, it just might have worked on the balloons a little bit. We'll be there. That's right, this Thursday is Thanksgiving. It's going to be Donald Trump's first Thanksgiving as president. And a lot of people are wondering what a Trump family Thanksgiving is like. Well, we have an expert on the topic. Please welcome tonight's show correspondent, Patty Harrison. Hey, Patty! Thanks, Jimmy. It's really great to be back. Uh, Patty, what can you tell us about the Trump's Thanksgiving plans? I'm actually a longtime friend of the family, so I eat with them every year. Really? You, mm -hmm. you spend Thanksgiving with the Trumps? Yeah, a few years ago, I told them I'm Eric Trump's wife, and no one questioned it. Makes sense. Okay, so how does a typical Trump family Thanksgiving work? Uh, first, let's talk seating arrangements. I sit at the big table with Donald, Melania, Ivanka, and Jared. Mm -hmm. Eric and Don Jr. sit at the kids' table. Oh, perfect, yep. And Tiffany sits outside. Okay, now, now do, you, do, do you guys say grace? Absolutely, Jimmy. The Trumps are a family driven by values. We all hold hands and read from the good book, The Art of the Deal. Okay, yeah. And, and, and then what happens? They bring out the turkey, and it's a free-for-all. Oh, wow. Eric grabs a wing. Ivanka grabs a thigh. Donald Trump grabs a turkey by the... All right, here, 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 here. Okay, uh, Patty, 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 wait a second. Uh, what about dessert? Do they have apple pie or pumpkin pie? Actually, for dessert, we have creme brulee which Melania flambes just by staring at it with her fiery gaze of steely regret. And... Wow. 
And, and how does the night end? It's beautiful. Um, Trump, Don Jr., and Eric all sit on the couch watching football. And if you squint hard enough, they start to look like the colors of the changing leaves. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. Thank you, Patty Harrison, everybody. Thank you, Patty. Hey, I saw that the Georgia Dome was demolished today in Atlanta. Did you see this? Oh, yeah. It's fantastic. <laughs> uh, a cameraman for the Weather Channel had a perfect shot lined up because they're going to demolish the, the Georgia Dome. Yeah? So he's got the all lined up, perfect shot, and then he ran into a little, little trouble. Take a look at this. There he goes. Uh oh. <laughs> 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 we, that's fantastic. Meanwhile, everyone on the bus is like, wow, what a view. When are you going to see something like this? It's award winning. Some news out of England. I saw that Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip are celebrating their 70th anniversary by getting new portraits together. It was a big day for them and a huge day for the photographer at Sears. Uh, <laughs> Talk your head like that. This is going viral at a high school wrestling match in Texas. A referee used a pretty interesting move to get in position. Take a look at this. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> what? That's it. Come on. <laughs> Can we see that again? I just want to just. I have it. Not about me, man. It's about the kids. Even crazy, <laughs> even crazier. He walked home like that. Are you yeah, serious? Yeah. <laughs> I think, I think it might be time to start drug testing the refs. <laughs> I, I really do. And finally, I read that for the first time, you're going to need a reservation to visit Santa at Macy's. Oh. But if you don't mind the smell of whiskey, there's still zero way to visit Santa at J.C. Penney. <laughs> we have a great show tonight. Give it up for the roots, everybody. Uh, uh -huh. Uh, I said. And it's on and on and on.